Okay, just having a little bit of fun here uh, for reference later on in the video. What you're going to be doing is looking into the end of this apparatus, which is a new vacuum system I'm putting together. So we're looking in the window. We got high voltage coming in the far end. That's where our gauge is. This stuff is not doing anything. And this very act controls a high voltage supply, which is a center tap neon sign transformer. The tank is hooked to the center tap and a couple of high voltage feed throughs get the, uh, the two poles. So, uh, Let's proceed to the fun part. I think this is making me realize I should be making a video for uh, vacuum beginners on how to get a rough idea of the vacuum versus um, what you see in the tank. Now here I have two high voltage feed throughs, one in the middle and one off to the side, connected to the opposite poles of a seven kilovolt neon sign transformer that's driving about 80, 90 volts into the input through a very active and we are at 1.2 E0 millibars, roughly speaking. I'm not sure I trust the gauge completely, but I just did calibrate it, sort of. And now let's start taking some gas out and watch what evolves here. This is obviously way too much for a fuser. When you hear a click, that's me allowing gas to be removed. You know, all those little sort of volcanic things at the bottom. There we go. That's a piece of stainless steel, a perforated metal I've using that would, in theory, make the field more uniform all over. And apparently there's little spots on it which would uh, like to get involved in the action here. And again, we're going up uh, some kilovolts between the two electrodes and then also the tank is grounded. So they're, they're seeing there be uh, opposite polarity. Right now this is 3.4 times 10 to the minus 1 millibar or 0.34 millibar of mostly nitrogen. I, I had let it mostly nitrogen. There's a little bit of oxygen in here now, by now too, but let's keep taking the gas out. Oh, we get a better show there. Ooh. Now, notice like almost the whole inside of the tank is somewhat glowing, or at least the part back by where the uh, electrodes are. It's just, just diffused glow in the tank. That's got to be good for knocking the water off the walls. Um... <laughs> and so on. And the color's changing too, a little bit. We'll keep taking gas out. There we go. we got almost a whole tank full. Now we got little sparkly things. This is fun. Uh, <laughs> just for silly stuff. Uh, let's keep on taking it out. What's going to happen is we're going to get to a non-conducting vacuum here pretty soon. Up oh, and there we are. And turn the voltage all the way up. That's it. We're done. And that's showing three times 10 to the minus three millibar. We just can't get a light. Okay, well, that's all for now.